Um, let's jump into some viewer emails right now. First, we've got Michael in Tennessee who wants to know, what's your take on the old adage, don't fight the Fed? First hey. off, I'll tell you, there's no such thing as a new adage, right? But I would say, guys, it, you have to actually, actually go back and look at the concept. You know, the Fed started cutting rates in 2000. The market crashed until 2002 when they started raising rates. They, rose, ra they raised rates the entire time the market was rallying from 2002 to 2006. Now we've been topping out. I think you gotta fight the Fed. It's flip it once again. Take conventional wisdom and turn it on its head. Next, I'm in Detroit. Uh, I'm sorry, Jim in Detroit writes. I'm not in Detroit, I'm in New York. <laughs> he writes, with the government sending out free money to, to everybody, shouldn't retail be a great investment right now? You know, guys, retail stocks have been on fire just like those financials. And you know, when the whole world is focused on saving industries like the retailers and the financials, and the government is colluding with the investment bankers to make sure everything plays out, safe Safely. Yeah, I would I would probably look at the retailers here. They've all been crushed already, at least for the near term. Three to six months, stick with the retailers. Finally, Shelly from Brooklyn wants to know, do you have a favorite investment in the video gaming industry, long or short? I mentioned it earlier in the show. I, I would like ERTS here, Electronic Arts, E-R-T-S. Stick with that one for two or three years. Play the cycle with it. I think it's a good one. On tap, guys, we're going to take a bite out of the sandwich generation. Something tells me I still might be hungry. I don't want to, guys, I might eat afterwards because we've got someone else coming too when Happy Hour returns.